Oi! Come here to me, you. Don't you be looking so clueless and come over here. I want a word with you. Come on, come here. Where have you been for the last couple of weeks, huh? What? What, what, are, you, what are you talking about? You know well what I'm talking about. For three months it was just me and you, every day, having great chats. I was listening to your problems. Coronavirus this, coronavirus that, pandemic this. I listened to you. I loved you. I absolutely loved you. And for the last ten days you haven't even said hello to me once. You haven't done anything to show affection to me. There's no need to be like that. Like, you know, like, I still, I'm still mad about you. Like, just because I don't come out as much anymore. Do you take me for some sort of a fool? For them three months you told me every day you love me. That if it wasn't for me, you'd go mad. I was your outlet. Come out here, talk to the flowers, have a conversation. You know, put water on me. Mind me. You haven't put water on me in at least ten days. It's all a bit of rain, that's all I got. But you haven't come out once and watered me. Terrible. But there's a, there's a hose pipe on it. What, what do you want me Hose pipe bomb, would you fuck off? You went out there on Monday night and booked a table, and I know well you spent over 105 minutes because you came home here drunk, had a sly cigarette out the back garden, and you pissed on me. You haven't pissed on me in months. They think that's good enough for me, and all I've done for you then during that pandemic, I'm sick of it. I absolutely, I thought you loved me. I fucking really did think that you loved me. And now you just walk by me like I'm not even there. I'm sick of it. Sorry, I'm sorry, right? I promise you I'll be out tomorrow morning. I promise, all right? Sorry. <laughs> You're just like the rest of them, so yeah. <laughs>